Subscribe to Film Companion for your film fix. Hit the bell icon so you never miss an update. I do use a different perfume for every character I play. Uh, really? So, yeah, I I don't know. It's just a quirk. Um, what happens is that it just it's it's very sensory, right? So you, uh, I think I immediately. So sometimes when there's a break in shooting, and I go back to the shoot, the moment I wear that perfume, I think something happens. It's it transports me to that world, that something. I try and do the same thing during promotions because the moment. I smell that. I feel maybe it's just something that I'm made up, but I feel it transports me back to that world. What are you wearing for Begum Jam? <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually um, wearing for Begum Jam Isimiyaki. It's because it's a very strong uh, perfume. So for Begum Jam, I needed something that wasn't mild and feminine. Also because we were shooting in Jharkhand, where <laughs> <laughs> we were sweating like pigs. <laughs> Do you have any rituals that you follow to hone your craft? Like I, I read somewhere that when you start to play a character, you always find a song for each character. Yes, yes. Uh, uh, because uh, I tried to find a way. I tried um, reading many books, uh, but nothing helps. You know, uh, they tell you how to do the research. What are the things? What is the format? And you do it. But when you are in front of the camera, you cannot play that research for some reason. I mean, it's there in your head, but it doesn't translate into what you do. So, like, okay, this is not the way. Uh, let me know exactly how my character would feel at that point of time. And the best way to do it, I think, is the rhythm. Also, because I think I started as a dancer, uh, so I get the rhythm so it correct. Connects. Rhythm correct. So, so I just somehow uh, find a song for each and every character of mine. Uh, probably when I, te I tell it to you, you won't find a. Uh, any connection tell between us, the two, uh, but uh, somehow it tells me that okay, this is the rhythm of the character, and everything that I say, everything that I'll do. Obviously, there are like stimulus, stimuli in between that will change it, but that's that's the bracket. This is what. So the, tell us some brackets. There's a. Uh, uh, I was going through the uh, YouTube songs, the VMs on Dhoni, uh, and there was this uh, South Indian song, uh, which I don't understand. But it was so correct uh, with the visuals. I was like, wow. So I don't understand it, but I used to hear it all the time. You're eating at 10 30 or what is it, 11 uh, Nutella toast and black coffee with ice. Is this the secret of the manic energy? I think so. Really? I think you've hit the nail on the head. This is actually the root of all evil. If, if you're wondering about my bad behavior, this is it. Copious amounts of black coffee. Too much for any one human being. And the Nutella? Uh, the Nutella is a mood. Bana hai. Achha. You know, at, it, you can just like, if you're somebody who eats Nutella, you would know that this just keeps a person happy. Right. You know? No need for anything else. You know, happy and energetic. Kaise rehte huh. you know, you, I often get asked, don't mind me. Hmm? Happy, aise rehte or energetic ether. This is the secret revealed today on Film Companion. For the first time! <laughs> In Jai Jai, the huh. reason I, I came with the with the holy uh, wrong colors on, right. uh, on me huh. was that I wanted to uh, bypass the 45 minutes of makeup time. Ah. So I just put color all over my face and it came straight to dance because yeah. that 45 minutes to sit down and do the makeup would take away a lot of uh, uh, you know from from the energy the amount of time that I, I could uh, spend on set dancing all day so I was trying to like minimize my physical uh, time as much as possible because it was really and conserve it for the shoot yeah, yeah. It was yeah. really really hectic stuff yeah. Yeah. But you so yeah that's why it. I came Colored up. Full. I woke up, colored, hello, <laughs> jaho, why dance karo. Why? Kitar hai shot. Ab shuru mein to karte the acting kariyas. 
जैसे हम हम लोगों का एक ग्रुप था बहुत सारे एक्टर्स थे बीस बाईस एक्टर थे उसमें कोई सीन वर्क तैयार सीन तैयार कर लिया हमने प्लेज के सीन तैयार कर कर रखे थे बीस बीस तीस स्पीचेज याद थी हमें हर प्लेज की कोई फिल्म देख के आते थे जैसे तो आपस में डिस्कस करते थे तो वो सीन अगर मैं होता तो ऐसे करता इस तरह की चीज़ें करते थे हम लोग और शुरू में तो जैसे हारमोनीम अभी भी है मेरे पास तो हार हारमोनीम पर प्रैक्टिस भी करते थे वॉइस की I'll read a scene or I'll read a script. Um, I try to find things in me because you have everything inside you that you need to play any character, right? You just have to adjust yourself. So you just have to, like, be like, "Acha, this thing in me is not doesn't work for Mamta." So I have a habit of reacting very quickly to something, right? I'll have an answer for everything. So Mamta is not like that, right? She will let things simmer. So find that inside me and put it down. Some other things which are in me, which also Mamta has. You raise, you raise those qualities. Like fine, I can be very shant, right? I oscillate between being very shant and being completely mental. So that shant wala, you usko upper leke aja. So you do when you've understood that, then the improvs allow you to have thoughts. So when you do a on the spot improv, uh, Varun you're this, Anushka you're that, and now you're sitting and having coffee, and apki yahan pe um, friend aaye aur ye aisa kar rahiye. then you'll have different thoughts and you should do a lot of improvs because when you go on, on to play that character these thoughts are not your thoughts these are the character's thoughts because you live that journey you should go to through different different parts of that character ki abhi jab ye aisa tha iske life mein aisa hua tab usne kaise react kiya and all of that that really helps i remember once i was uh, uh, sitting with uh, sharuk so and he was like just at a party we were having this conversation you were also there i think uh, and he said something like sometimes it's wrong to be too natural on screen also like it's you think that you feel a shot or you feel like i felt this one and all but it's not necessarily translating on screen sometimes you have to put it on even anupam k told me the same thing so That's when I realized that there is something called filmy acting, which is there is a little more than what you would feel. Um, where I always thought that if I'm feeling it or if I'm being natural and casual, it's enough. But sometimes it's not enough. I I think I thrive in front of an audience the most. I enjoy this. I, there are some people in the balcony also. Yes. Hi guys. So I think I. I I enjoy when there's an audience watching me. I love doing something. I love performing. But but when you're in front of a movie camera, there isn't an audience except for the crew. So how are you create? Are you are you acting It's for the crew? The best thing when a light boy or a spot boy or something like hey, अच्छा लगा. They criticize actors, and because I've been an assistant, if some actor is like screwing, screwing up a scene, they say अरे घटिया actor है. Director अच्छा कर रहा था. So behind the scenes, they are constantly that happens. So I have a Uh, like that like that i understand i have my i, I have my tuning with them with if and i swear to god there have been times when one of the light men have told me to do one more take and i've gone back to the director and say ki ek aur karte se really and he's like kyu and you said the light man told I, me so are you mad i've thrown out the set <laughs> i've only told uh, i think uh, shashank that isne bola hai and shashank has just like he's announced it on set that this is This guy, he's not performing for us or the audience. Is kille kar raha hai. Abhi kar do. 